I really don't want to turn this into a race thing, so if you're going to leave any comments in this video, please don't leave any racist comments. Try not to argue with people. I know it's difficult on social media, but this really dawned on me this morning and I thought maybe we could discuss it without fighting. I was reading through the comments of the video where Lily's arguing with Thomas and Khaled on Friday night and as I was reading through them I was thinking these comments are very different from when Hannah and Martha were arguing even though they were showing similar behaviour but I think that Hannah was justified in her actions because she was basically being attacked by the whole house she was being called a liar to her face and Lily was just doing it because she's a spoiled child I seen this comment and I thought I do agree with this to some degree because as a Scottish person I get labelled as aggressive all the time and a lot of people get labelled as aggressive. Look at what happened to Olivia last year. She was just talking to people and people were saying, oh she's loud, she's aggressive and I was like, oh my god, like if that's what they think of her, what are they going to think of me? Now obviously some of these comments are going to be made because of skin colour, accent or whatever else. Like when Martha and Hannah were arguing and she called Shagan down and she was like clicking her fingers and I was like, oh my God, like I didn't think she was being aggressive whatsoever. But I was like, that, oh, that's a bit rude. But then I found out that that's a cultural thing and it's not rude at all. And I was like, right, cool, I didn't know that. Sorry. Another thing is that Scottish people, Germans and Russians are often labelled as aggressive because of the way they speak. And you often hear people say, oh, when you hear Germans speaking, they always sound like they're arguing. They say that about Scottish people as well. So it isn't always about skin colour, even though sometimes it is. I only found out about the angry black women stereotype a couple of years ago. And when I first heard it, I was like, is that a thing? Like, how does that even make sense? But obviously it is a thing. So let's get into the comments and then you can tell me what you think. And please just try to be nice. Please. Oh yeah, in regards to this comment as well. When Martha and Hannah were arguing, Martha almost said, why are you so aggressive or why are you so angry? And then changed it to pressed, because obviously she didn't want to come across as being racist. But the reason I agree with this comment to some extent is that when you say, oh, Scottish people are aggressive, Russians are aggressive, Germans are aggressive, some of them are aggressive. Like, if I was in that house and somebody blatantly made me out to be a liar and the house was ganging up on me, you would see what aggressive looks like. I thought that Hannah handled it. Oh my God, she was so calm compared to what I'd have been like. Honestly, like calling somebody a liar to their face is like the worst. I got these comments from the video of Martha and Hannah arguing on Facebook. Over there, comments are less likely to be removed. I have comments removed on TikTok every single day and I've not even said anything bad. Like I've actually been complimenting people and it's removed. So over there, it's not as strict. This top comment about talking like a gangster, I've seen several of these and I've seen them at the time and people were saying, why is she speaking like gang talk? Why is she using gangster language? And I thought, has this person never heard a gangster speak before? Like, what was gangster about that? And I, I actually did think that that was a racist comment. Why do you let Hannah use threatening behaviour? And what, what threatening behaviour? I didn't see any threatening behaviour. Yes, she was raising her voice and yes, she was standing up, but she was being accused of being a liar. And then when she got shagging down and Martha was like, oh, call on your wingman, I was like, that. oh my God. Oh my God. Like, how is she How is she containing herself? I was like, oh, she's doing amazing. Don't like either of them. Martha is sly and Hannah needs to grow up trying to threaten people with her number six temper. Where was she threatening people? Yes, she said, don't speak to me like that. I've told people in the house not to speak to me like that. But she didn't say, don't speak to me like that or I'll do this. So there was there was no threats whatsoever. Like, are people just that sensitive or are they just that thick? I'm not sure. Why is Hannah not being pulled up for threatening behaviour? Funny how she wouldn't say anything to Ali. More like Ali wouldn't say anything to her. Hannah acting all hard to impress the boys. She's not trying to impress any boys in that house. Hannah speaks with aggression, I'm just saying what I'm seeing. I don't know why this person is seeing this. i just seen somebody defending herself. Are women not allowed to defend herself? Is that a problem? Hannah was so aggressive and can't hold a quiet conversation without getting personal. So during that argument, Hannah said to Martha, why are you weird or I think you're weird? And Dean was instantly like, don't get personal and shut her down like that. 
Nathan also said to her several times, there's no need to raise your voice, there's no need to shout. Where was that energy on Friday night with Lily? I went to the comments of Lily arguing with Thomas and Khaled, where she also raised her voice, called them weird several times, stood up from the table and continued to shout, screwed up her face in an aggressive manner. And I went to screenshot some comments saying that she was aggressive. None. Crickets. Zero. People were saying she's selfish, she's obnoxious or whatever, but not one comment saying she was aggressive. I went to the same video of Hannah and Martha arguing on TikTok. It did take me a wee bit longer to find these comments, I must admit, but it was overly aggressive in what was Martha doing. Martha was being a bitch. She's incredibly aggressive and petty. There, there were so many comments of people saying, oh, she's petty, she holds a grudge like Martha apologised, and she asked her for a hug and she tell her no. Fucking right she tell her no. Imagine somebody made you out to be a liar and tried to turn the whole house against you when it was something that was your fault. Now I'm getting aggressive, okay? This is why people call me aggressive and I'll be like that, I am. But it's not because I'm Scottish, it's because people are fucking wind me up. And I'm getting angry on Hannah's behalf. I wasn't even there. Why should she just accept somebody's apology just for the sake of it? Wouldn't be me. No, she can get defensive without getting aggressive and yelling. 100%. Like, usually if I'm arguing with somebody, I tend to just be passive-aggressive and sarcastic and make them out to be an idiot. But if somebody calls me a liar and I am not lying, that is when I flip. It's one thing that I can't stand. Hannah was getting aggressive for no reason. She needs to knock down a few pegs. If anybody out there could honestly say that somebody would make them out to be a liar to their face and try and turn the house against them when it was that person's fault, and they would just be like, all right, no hassles, bestie. They're fucking liars. I've accidentally added that comment in twice, but as you were looking at that, you can also see how many likes these comments have got. So even though overall you might not find hundreds and hundreds of these comments, there's hundreds of likes on them. Went to the video of Lily arguing with Thomas and Khaled on TikTok to see if I could find anything about aggression. Zero. Crickets. Non-existent. Now again, I'm not trying to turn this into a race thing, but I feel like people who like Lily will defend her to the death. I had somebody comment earlier, saying that Lily wasn't selfish and I listed all the things that she had done in the house and they said, well, that's your opinion and you're entitled to it. And I, okay, we all have different opinions, but facts, Lily is selfish. Now, I'm certainly not trying to say that Hannah's perfect. The other night during the Vampires and Villagers task, I didn't like the way she was acting, but I still didn't think she was being aggressive. Now, even though I have showed you the evidence in black and white in rainbow font, Maybe I just don't see that Hannah is an angry black woman because I'm an angry Scottish woman. Who knows? You can let me know in the comments without having a racist argument, please. That's all I ask. I tried not to swear in this video because my sounds get removed. And I'll see you again tonight. Bye! Oh, one quick thing before I go. When Lily was arguing with Thomas, she was actually pointing at him. She's like, and you, and you, and you. And I was like, holy fuck, man. She needs to calm herself. And please, before anybody says, Lily's young, she's still learning or whatever else. She's an adult, she's 20 years old, and Hannah's 24 years old. And I know that four years can make a lot of difference in your life, but come on to fuck. Let's be real.